okay good evening guys so as per as part of installation right what you have to do okay go to sr technologies ravindra reddy under that you have a playlist okay in that playlist okay there is a sql playlist okay in sql playlist you can go here okay once you go here then you can see here in the last last sql learning step by step okay sql learning step by step video here okay in this particular video okay if you can go through this video then you will be able to install it properly okay most of the guys didn't do that till now okay i don't know the reason okay you guys can't go for even 14 minutes then it will be a very difficult thing okay now once you do this right there is a oracle software link here okay you can click on it here okay once you click on there is a download link okay download it just you can click on it here and it is going to ask you download anyway okay this is the oracle part and then next thing is what you have to do again you go through here okay in this same thing sql developer link also okay once you do sql developer link okay sql developer same thing you can click on it here download anyway it is going to do okay after that what you can do you can go here in the video again okay you, once you would go here there is a 7g software link just click on it here and the same process okay you can go here and download it i have already downloaded it, it is a unnecessary downloading it so next thing is important very very important thing after you download it right just go here installation guide installation guide so this one just you can see here installation guide is exist okay oracle installation guide just you can go here once you download it right once you download it so these are the rare files which is going to present in your system rare files are you clear guys are you are you there are you there so rare files which is going to present so once you go here what you have to do okay go to downloads okay just go to downloads here you can see downloads okay downloads here in this particular case okay you are going to get this particular files so once you do that double click on it once you do double click on it automatically it is going to ask you step by step okay So once you do that, then automatically what is going to happen here, you can see the extracted folder, which is going to come like this. Okay. This particular thing in this particular folder, you have this particular files. Okay. Go to this particular folder. Okay. If you go to this particular folder, there is a disk one. Okay. You open the disk one folder under that, under that folder. Okay. You can see here, there is a installation setup. You click on this, you click on this automatically what is going to happen it is going to ask you like this okay setup you need to say yes here you need to press yes once you press yes automatically it is going to start the installation it is going to start the installation you need to wait for a few minutes guys are you following me or not everyone are you following me or not So here, once you do that, right, then what is going to happen? It is going to ask you next. Okay. Again, here you need to make sure you have to do license agreement. You have to do license agreement. Just you need to click on license agreement. You have to accept the terms and conditions. Once you do that, then click on next. Okay. There is a folder which is going to come into by default. Then you can click on next. Okay. Then after you do next, then here it is going to ask you password. You need to set up the admin admin password okay because if you can do this it is going to be it is going to be easy okay once you set up this password this is the password you have to remember forever are you clear this is the password you have to remember forever okay once you remember this password okay then after that okay after a certain time what is going to happen it is going to say install okay 
once you do installation click on install then it is going to it is going to take few minutes okay it is going to take few minutes and after that it is going hidden it is going to it is going to show finish okay finish option which is going to come then click on finish that's it installation is done okay are you clear guys everyone are you clear any doubts you can unmute it and you can ask me if you have any doubts still if if anybody have any doubts let me know and this guide also which is present very clearly it is not going to be very step by step even small small things also which i have care and i have already uploaded in the link also in that particular video link does anyone have any doubt on this uh ravi uh, chandran here ravi as discussed from 13th page i have doubt i stuck in 13th page i tried reaching you so you are busy today so from 13th page i got stuck See, what is the stuck you let me know i'll help you out. but uh, don't go with the 13th 13th okay i'll, I'll oh, okay. that this... renaming renaming alter uh, hr tables See, try to understand this. Okay, let me finish it up this. Then you will cl get clear about it. Okay. Sure, sure. So this particular thing, once you have done this, right, then you have to extract the Oracle also, SQL developer. SQL developer is the tool which is going to be, which is going to be basically what is going to happen, right? So Oracle is the database. You wanted to go ahead and extract the you wanted to connect to the oracle in a gui mode okay graphical user interface mode if you wanted to connect there is a sql developer tool just you can go ahead and go to the sql developer folder and there is a okay there is a sql developer you can see here sql developer icon you can click on that icon once you click on double click on it automatically it will open this page are you clear everyone Guys, say yes or no in the chat so that I'll I'll go further. So it is going if you can double click, it is going to take some time. Okay. It is going to take some time and it is going to open this. Okay, SQL developer. Once it is opened, okay then you can go ahead and you can do okay you can pin to taskbar just right click on pin to taskbar and after that okay you click on here just you can see here okay you can see here new database connection okay if you can click on new database connection automatically what is going to happen it is going to show you can see here let me show you okay you can click on this So if you can open this, right? Just give me one second. It is stuck actually. Or we can see here. Yo. Okay. Here you can see. Okay. Just give me a sec. You can see here, right? You if you can click on right, just you can give system first one. Okay. After that, you have to do HR. It's not HR system okay remember this and the password which you have set it up i mentioned as admin okay and then here you have you need not to give anything by default it is going to take everything after that you need to test it up here you can see success which is going to come success which is going to come if you follow entire process if you follow entire process are you clear okay now you you just go ahead and save it okay save it and connect okay if you connect it okay now second thing is what you have to do you have set it up system but you can't see okay you can't see hr connection okay hr connection to do that what you have to do right you have to go ahead and you have to use these commands okay you have to use these commands okay these commands where it is it you should enter in the here okay you have to go ahead and you have to enter here once you enter here, okay, alter user HR, account unlock, alter HR, identify. See, try to understand. This is the HR account which is already available 
available in the where which is available in the system okay by default it is coming now what you are setting you are unlocking as well as you are setting up as hr is the user and hr is the password okay password so once you do this then automatically you can go ahead and you can see here okay you can go ahead and you can create a new database connection here you can pass okay this is the hr schema again you can go here user is hr and password also hr then you can test it up okay just one minute guys i have given capital okay so you can test it up here you can see here success okay and after that you can save it here i already saved it this particular thing once you save it up okay then what is going to happen just connect it okay one minute guys this is you can see here all the tables which is present okay all the tables are you clear are you clear chandan so this is what you have to set it up and you need not to worry about scott uh ravi sorry to disturb you uh, and can i just share my screen is it okay yes go ahead please sure just a yeah. so this is a even it's a in detail explanation which i have given yes yes uh, I, I now I understood. Just wanted to recheck on, reconfirm. So this is the same thing, right? I, I did, actually did this is not an installation class because people yeah, are right. leave, leaving already. Okay, a lot of people yeah. are left because which uh, they have already installed. Okay, mm -hmm. so go ahead. I don't want to uh, stop you. Go ahead. Sure, sure. So this are you can able to see my screen. Right? Not yet. Actually, I'm stay. I'm sharing my screen as of now. You can. Yes. So now, I have done this two, two commands, uh, two syntax. So now I need to run it, right? Yes, you have to run it. Just okay. done, right? Now you can create a new database connection. Here, 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 not there, not there. There is a plus symbol bottom connections. Yeah, you can click on that. Okay, HR. Okay, downside, small HR, not capital. Not kept as small. You have given small HR. Downside also username also small HR. Small HR. Yeah, same thing. Small HR. Then test it. Test it. You can see success. Unconnect yeah. it. Yeah, connect it. Now you can with, with tables. Go to tables here. Yeah. Know, under HR. Go to tables okay. here. Okay. okay. These are the okay. tables which is by default it is going to be present now. We are going to work on the employees. Can you select select star from employees? I'll explain you. Select, click on it. Select, select space, select space, space. You need not to do. You know. okay. Select star from star from employees guys uh, maybe this is the call which is installation just to run it no need to select it just run it automatically it will run just maximize it once maximize your screen Just run one more time. Yeah. yeah, you can see data. Okay. Yeah. Like that, if you can select each and every table, every table is having same thing. Okay. Oh. Are, are you clear? Sure. Yes, yes. Thank you. Okay. Thanks. So, yeah, you can stop your sharing your screen. Okay. If anybody yes. is having any, anyone is having installation part, let me know. I'll clear it today. Tomorrow onwards, we are not going to see any disturbances on the uh, this particular area. Anybody have any questions? Yeah. Oh. Hi, Vinod here. Can yes. I share my screen? Yes, Vinod. Uh, let me do that. Guys, uh, sorry to do this. Okay. Because a lot of people are facing issues. Even though we have done everything, it doesn't make any sense. Actually, let uh, people understand. Yeah. You have downloaded everything, yeah. right? Okay. Yeah. Now install the that application 7-Zip part. Yeah, already installed. 
Okay, then just right click on this rare file. Okay. Show more options. Okay. Okay, go to 7zip. Here. Okay. Okay. O o extract to down down. Extract to Oracle, Ex this folder. Yeah, okay. do that. Do that. Yes. You already did it. Huh? Yes to all. You can click on yes to all. Yeah. Okay, okay. you already extracted. Same thing you okay. do for SQL developer. Yes, this is an installation class. Please bear with me. Okay, tomorrow onwards we'll continue our class. I don't want to see same issues again and again. Yeah, extract same thing. Guys, observe this. Okay, I'll post it anyway, this particular class. Okay. Yeah. In the done. done, right? Go to that Oracle extracted folder. Not this one. Oracle extracted folder. Where did you extract it? No, go to downloads. Okay, you already okay. extracted it, right? That okay. extracted folder. Oracle one. Just do date modified. On if you can click on this, okay. Automatically this folder will come. Date modified. Yeah. Okay. This one. Go to that. Okay. Double click on open that. Double click on it, man. It will open. This one open. Yeah. Here setup is there, right? Click on that. Double click on that setup. It will ask you yes or no. Say yes. Did you do that? Double click. Yes, I do. Yeah. There is a option will come. Yes or no. Okay. Yeah. So this is the way it is going to install, guys. Okay. Just wait for some time. Next, click on next. I I accept the terms and license agreement. Yes, next. Okay, next. Okay, here you need to set the password. You set it up admin. Yeah, same. You need to repeat the password admin. Okay, next. Install it. It's not going to take much time okay but if based on your system capacity if system capacity is having all the memory as well as cpu properly okay number of courses properly then it will work very faster it is not going to take even 10 to 15 minutes it is not even take five minutes also sometime okay based on the installation guys make sure you need to install this tomorrow onwards we are going ahead and we are going to do directly Yes, done. Okay, you have done finished, right? Fine. Right. No, there is a one more option which is going to come. Installation, install. Did you do okay. that? No, not yet. It is going to take time. Did you do that or not? No, I, I don't. Don't. Okay, just go to here in the windows, windows, windows here in the windows bottom of the screen. Not yes. there, man. Guys, listen yeah. to me. Yeah, yes. search bar. Search bar. Yeah. Yeah. Click on it. SQL. Yeah, it is installed. Okay. Just go now go to SQL developer, which you have extracted. Downloads. Downloads. Okay. Go to SQL developer. Just click on date modified. Yeah. Here you see, right? File folder. Yeah, that yeah. fourth one. Yeah, click on it. Okay, go to this folder under come bottom, bottom of the screen. Yeah, come down. Here you can see, right? Application 89 KB. Click on double click on that. Yeah, it is going to take some time. Okay. Okay. Let it run, open that. Say no. Click on OK. OK, maximize it. Screen maximize it. OK, now go to new connection. There is a plus button, right? I have shown you just before. Yeah. There is a drop down. Yeah. Click system. 
write it up system. Yeah, come down, write it up system. Username is system. And password, what, what did you set it up? S-Y-S-T-E-M. -S password, what did you set it up? Admin. Yeah, you type it admin only. And yes. click on, there is a save, save password. You can click on it, okay? It is not enterprise, okay? Then test it up here, test. You can see success and save. Yes. There is a wait, wait, save, save here, save. Okay, then connect. Okay, now go to that uh, whatever video which I have given, right? Go to that video link and open the alter comments. Come down, bottom, bottom. Yeah, here. See, this is a self-explanatory. Uh, still, people are unable to do that. I don't understand. Yeah, copy those two comments. Click on, paste it, run it up. Run. Okay. Just wait some time. It is going to take some time. It has to make connection right first time. Did you run it up? Yeah, it Oops. is altered. Now click on plus symbol again. Okay, same thing, HR. HR, HR. Okay, again, same, save password. Save, again, save. Anyway, it will work, okay, test it. Test, save, test. Oh, connect. Okay. Open HR. Do down click. There. Yeah. See here. Okay. See, try to let me explain you. Okay. All the folks. See, when you have a schema objects, HR is the schema. In that schema, you can see tables, views, indexes, packages, procedures, functions, operators. Okay. Wait, man. <laughs> Let me. Okay. Operators. Queues. Okay. See, schema is nothing but a logical structure in the database. Okay. Logical. Each user is going to have different schema. So now, under each schema, you are going to see schema objects. Schema objects. What are those objects? Tables, views, indexes, packages, procedures, functions, operators, queues, queue table, queues tables, triggers, types, sequences, materialized views. Metalized view logs, synonyms, public synonyms, database links, public database links. When I have explained yesterday, okay, remember this and all I have covered as part of our course or not? Everyone, did I cover this or not? See, yes or no, guys, whether you are part, part of class or not. Second class only, you guys are like this, then I don't know. <laughs> 